y'all welcome back to my channel and today i'll be giving y'all a new product my girls say they don't want to hear another story all they ever do is just ignore me i'm calling and calling you i need you to come over now he never play because i'm never if you don't know tgin they recently uh dropped two new products for the rose water collection they dropped a curl cream along with a styling lotion this is what the curl cream looks like hopefully you saw the label sometimes i'm not good at having the label front and center this is the styling lotion if you're new here subscribe and check out my past videos then comment below are you purchasing trying this do you like tgin let me know so i washed and conditioned my hair with the camille rose rosemary shampoo and then i went in with a second shampoo with the tgin's uh miracle repair x shampoo and then I went in with the protein treatment from TGIN and the same Miracle Repair X uh, collection. Right now, I have the Rose Rotor leave-in conditioner in because on the you know packaging, it says that you can use the leave-in with this. So hopefully, it don't flake or anything. I'm not too sure how these products is going to hold up on its own. So I do have the uh, rose water gel that I haven't used in like forever. So it's a little dusty. If I feel like it needs more hold, I will go in with the rose water because I only do my hair once a week. I can't do this again. Like. So, um, if you see that my little thing is like red, it's because I did the As I Am curl color, so it's just all over. So let's get into the curl cream. I think that's what I'll be using. Uh, on their Instagram, they said it's supposedly formulated with no silicones. Um, I didn't know they had silicones in here. Or sulfates or anything of that sort you know I forget that the product isn't pink but the bottles are pink so if you ever purchase this thinking the product is pink it's not it's the packaging that's pink he won't use the styling lotion simply because it says it's for well it's for the styling lotion, it says it's a lightweight hydrating styler, perfect for setting braid outs, twist outs, roller and rod sets. Smooths with a soft hole, delivering a non-greasy finish. So, yeah. So I don't know how that would do since I'm doing a wash and go, and they say the curl cream is good for the wash and go. So that's what I'll be using. It's a medium hole styling cream, perfect for wash and goes. Provides lightweight hydration and defines curls. So hopefully I won't need the gel. It's looking like with just the leave-in in. If I do small sections, you know, I've never done a video on TGIN, but I haven't used any other products besides the rose water and I like rose water the rose water products so I was like maybe I like these and that's why I'm doing this video today so let's see
I'm just making sure that every strand is, you know, coated. I'm not missing anything. It seems like I won't be needing the gel. Like it seems like it's really clumping my curls. From what I can see in the mirror. I will add, you know, a little bit more. This is what the product is looking like. I would say it's not like too thick. It's like nice and a little creamy. I add just like a little dab. Just about that much to see what the gel would do. To see like if it would on just this little piece right here. Just to see how it does. Not too much. I just want to see what the whole difference will be on these little pieces and if it will flake. I think that's it for this little section. Just a little bit, not too much, because I know I have a lot of leave-in in. But yeah, if a curling cream can hold my hair with like a good little hole that'll last me a week, I'll be surprised. got these products when they were on sale they had like a little sale a few weeks ago and I think the products were like eight dollars so I was like let me get this because we all love a good sale like it's really curling my hair I feel like my root area is like my problem areas because it never is, it never is like defined. I feel like this top part is not gonna work right. I'm not gonna touch this side anymore. I'm gonna be done with it because I don't know. Okay, I think that's it for me on this side. Depending on how, depending on how it dry, I might go back in with the gel, just to have like a little bit more hole in the areas that you know that probably won't last as long. I will say I always love the smell of these products. It smells so good. So this is what it's looking like. Um, I'm not too sure. 
what it's going to turn out, but from the look of it, it's going to be like, I feel like it's going to give me what the Maya mousse gives me, and I like the Maya mousse, so we'll see. I might just put a little gel. This is my problem area. I can tell that the gel did not mix with these products, so don't do what I'm doing do not mix at all so so I'm gonna quit messing and come back when it's fully dried so yeah see you in a few hours hey y'all so I'm back and this is how my hair is dry I'm not seeing any flakes. This is how my hair dry. I'm not seeing any flakes as of right now, but it has like a soft hold on. Well, my hair is defined, if you can't tell. I'm not sure how long this will last, but Hopefully it can last me a whole week, but I'm gonna get it through a whole week. This was the curl cream from the Rosewater collection of TGIN. Um, let me know who you think of the, you know, results. And if you'll, you know, try it. This is uh, on their website for like $15.99. I did see, I did see like the lotion on Ota's website, so it might be coming there soon. So it's giving. I like it. I, I had little hope because I don't usually just use a curl cream because sometimes creams just don't have that hold that I'm looking for, like a gel. But I might just use this uh, regularly, like I use the uh, Maya mousse. Because right now that mousse is my one product wash and go, so my wash and goes is like quick. My wash day is like less than an hour. Well, I said like less than less than an hour and thirty. So yeah, so I can get it to an hour if needed. So if you enjoyed this video, comment and subscribe. Let me know if you want to see next, and let me know your thoughts on the uh, results. So, see you guys.